Hey, Cheryl Lazar coming to you from VidCon with Mike Hudak from Blip TV. How you doing, Cheryl? I'm good. So you were here to talk about you know the future of video beyond YouTube, which is important for people to know that there's a lot going on sure. beyond YouTube as well. Yeah, well, I, I think that YouTube is going to be a very large part of video for a very long time, and I don't think we should discount that. Um, but certainly, there are, you know there are a lot of people who are distributing video on their own sites, who are watching video on sites like AOL and Hulu and iTunes and all of these different places out there. And YouTube is huge, um, but I think it's important for creators to diversify as well. Yeah, and Blip TV, what is that all about for people that don't know what it is? So we provide services of scale to independent show producers. So technology, workflow automation, distribution, um, we can publish to YouTube, but also to iTunes and TiVo and Fios and um, AOL and MSN and Yahoo and all these places. Uh, and then we sell advertising across the whole network and do a rev share with producers. Why would it be important for someone who has a following on YouTube or just is, ha, creates online video to be with Blip? Well, I think that for some people, we provide a really valuable service to help them you know, monetize their traffic more effectively than YouTube sometimes can, to help them find audiences outside of YouTube and diversify a little bit so that, you know, we think it's very important that show producers own their audience, own their IP, own everything that they do um, because that's where the power comes from and so our job is to facilitate that and I think that when you solely rely on a single platform um, you know you, you're in a somewhat vulnerable position if that platform changes or, or what have you so you know we help folks build sites and um, get some traffic there monetize that traffic and develop a second revenue stream. So as someone who's on the other end of the spectrum, not a content creator necessarily, what advice can you give the creators out there to get seen? Well, I think the most important thing you can do at this point is find out where your audience hangs out. And that could be, you know, with another YouTuber. It could be on a site. Like if you have a video game show, there are so many video game sites and blogs out there that you can participate in the community. Um, you can go out there and, you know, email the guys at Apple and get promoted on the, you know, on the podcast directory. But you have to hustle and you have to participate in the community. Um, you have to find the people who can share their audiences with you because one plus one equals three. Um, and you got to, you know, you got to hustle. Awesome. All right. Hustle. Hustle. It's all hustle. Thank you, Mike. Thank you, Sarah.